brought to us today? I've got two things. Uh, one is this stuffed tiger that I made in Charlie's when they did like a Build-A-Bear thing. Oh. Um, that was a uh, Valentine's 2005 apparently. This is actually something they used to send to prospective students. Mm -hmm. um, and it's sort of a scrapbook of life on campus. And I actually worked in the PR department for my assistantship. Okay. So um, the year I came on, they had me like rewrite it and update it. Um, so it's signed by all of my freshman year friends. I worked in the basement of Seals Grove Hall. And um, uh, basically I was helping edit things for prospective students, mm -hmm. things for the alumni magazine. I did some interviews for that of alumni. Um, and so it was kind of the most fun when you could kind of be creative and do kind of cut and pasting stuff like this and like hit up your friends for ideas. Mm -hmm. So when I was here, um, campus didn't recycle, like save ran recycling. So we would empty all the bins everywhere and we would gather everything up, shove it in the bike closet in cyber. Mm -hmm. Like that thing was just full of garbage. And we would then borrow one of the maintenance trucks, fill it with the recycling and drive it, God only knows, somewhere in the middle of nowhere, like a half hour from here and take it to a recycling center. They would pay us for our cans, which would be just enough to buy pizza for the four kids who came. So we would go buy pizza and then we'd come back. Wow. So we ran the recycling program. Wow. So have you heard of the board game Imagine If? Um, so. Okay, oh. well the way it works is if you don't have enough players, you write in people that everybody knows because mm -hmm. you have to kind of guess how people will react to things. So it has to be somebody everybody has in common. So we would put down LJ as our missing player and uh, one time I ran into him and told him that and he invited all of us to his house to play board games oh. with him and the kids. <laughs> and they brought like cookies from the good catering. Ooh. So that was really exciting.